Hey gang, Larry Bailey here with Awesome Technologies Inc. I just got off a partner advisory board meeting with the awesome Tom Lyons from Ice Mortgage Technology, who I've known since 2011, um, back before Ice bought uh, the company. I don't know if it's this company or not. Anyway, it doesn't matter. It's uh, we all know it as EPPS, and I want to show you what it looks like on the web because I just got a little bit of training. And I want to show you what it looks like. So here's uh, just a bunch of test loans. I'm going to go into this first Andy America. <clears throat> and then um, over here, the thing, the way it is now, um, it's, it's a little bit different. So if you're on the web, you can actually price and lock through the web, uh, Encompass Web. Um, but what you want to do is, I know, I know it might feel good to go over into um, the lock request form, things like that, but that's actually today with EPPS. You want to go to, to the uh, uh, kebab over here and you want to click on search for product and pricing. That's going to bring up this little window and you'll select encompass product and pricing, click next. And uh, from here, you'll go ahead and, and pick your, your information. Here's your checkbox we're used to. Um, and as far as uh, basic information that comes through, it's fetching the information from the loan file that you're in if you've gone through. So if I just want to select a uh, 30-year term, and if I want to select agency and FHA, I don't have any product options. I don't have any special products. Uh, lock period, I'm just going to pick a 45-day lender comp. Uh, target rate is 8.5% uh, and, and all this other stuff. Click search. So <clears throat> this is, again, um, this UI is going to change a little bit. I've been told later on this year in 2024 is the game plan. So. Uh, what's important to understand is, again, this is live right now. You can do this. So if you wanted to come over and, and figure out, you know, which which one you want and what the rate is, et cetera, if you want to click the details, um, you know, for the for the one that's you know, just above par here, <clears throat> we can come over and, and get your hits. You can click Save the Loan, which is going to update that loan file, or you can actually request a lock. So the Saving the Loan part, a lot of folks uh, tend to miss just because it's maybe not intuitive for them, but um, when trained properly, it's super easy. And that's gonna bring that seven and five eighths back into the loan file as a result, as well as um, any other details that have been updated in the request. It'll bring it back to the lock request form. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, so if, um, if you're looking to, so we can see, um, you know, the note rate still show, showed eight and a half, now it shows 7.625. Um, so it updates the loan file easy enough if you want to deal, you know, if you want to save that stuff, go ahead and click save. But it's this part over here that I just want to draw to everyone's attention because it's not like desktop. Um, so just select it, click next. And again, you'll, you'll kind of go through that information. So that's my quick hit for, uh, for today, the 23rd of February. Um, thanks very much. And if I ever, can ever answer any questions or help you, you can always reach me using Larry at ATIHelps.com. Take care, everybody.